Ron Mason just dropped. This cannot be real. The last video we reacted to, my brother just died almost 18 times was a crazy video. But this, we're gonna be checking out Getting Recognized in the Wild by Emanations. I'm so excited. If you're new to the channel, hit the like button, subscribe. But no further ado, let's get straight into it. <laughs> Yeah, no. I break out of my shell, and I love meeting you guys. Then when I go back home, I crawl back into my shell. Now, it's gonna be hard to tell a story about people recognizing me without sounding egotistic. But yeah, rest egotistic. assured, oh, I real. am a humble person. Like, I am so incredibly humble. I'm way more humble than you. I'm the most humble person there has ever been. With that <laughs> I love how he just expresses himself. I'm so humble. Hey, man, we get it, man. You humble, bro. But some of you guys, when you see your favorite YouTuber or something, y'all gotta chill out. You gotta give them some space sometimes. I know y'all want to rush to them. Hey, can I take a picture? But, like, they normal people, too, bro. Y'all got to chill out sometimes, bro. Like, we never seen this picture. Why am I keep seeing his butt on the screen? <laughs> I don't know if I'm just infatuated with twerking, but, like, I am keep seeing butt. <laughs> you hey, that would just freak me out. I would be nervous, too. Because, at least, bro, as y'all see, I'm a YouTuber. And people say, what do you do for a job? And if I say a YouTuber, they probably won't even take me <laughs> serious. <laughs> Like, it, it sucks, bro. Y'all don't understand, like, how much pressure I have. I feel like I'm just sweating 24-7 just telling people that. So I relate to him. Bro, stop grilling me and go get me some breadsticks. Some and bread this sticks. whole time, my mom is just <laughs> using all her restraint to not expose me. But for the first time ever, she kept her mouth shut. I was safe that time. But here's a time my family wasn't so considerate. I was taking Bo for a walk with my brother Brody and his wife Jen, and I was looking crusty that evening. It was a messy hair and sweatpants we kind always of day got those days, everybody for the fifth day in a row. Anyway, we had a nice walk and stopped at a playground and started casually chatting and swinging. Just as I was thinking about telling Bo to go down a slide, one of the kids says, Are any of you guys YouTubers? Nope. Look, I didn't want to get caught, especially since I was looking crusty, okay? <laughs> Are you sure? We heard someone say the name Bryson. Huh, that's weird. At this moment, Brody and Jen couldn't hold it in anymore, and they yelled, That's, that's Bryson, Bryson from Emanations. Go! Why would you put your friend on blast like that? He just said he looked at crusty. He don't want to get exposed at this time. He don't want to get recognized. Put in the comment section, have you ever went to like a grocery store or something, or you see somebody that you notice or recognize? and you just felt embarrassed because the way you looked at that moment? Put in the comment section, because I always had that moment. Somebody say, hey, are you rainy? And I just try to put a hoodie over my head just so they don't know it's me. <laughs> Honestly, bro, I always do that, bro. God dang, he's choking like that. Help to save this man. They just care about him being a YouTuber. You ain't gonna save your favorite YouTuber? You gonna let him choke? Be honest, would y'all help him? Or y'all gonna care about taking a picture? Like, for real. This kid literally took the videos to real life. He don't beat people up in videos. Imagine your favorite YouTuber beating someone in a video and you approach them and they think it's real. <laughs> He's like, what? <laughs> you look at his own content like, oh, I didn't even realize I did that. <laughs> Sorry. That's like me bringing a girl to my house at my age and showing her I love Pokemon. Them girls go think that I'm weird, <laughs> like honestly. But if she's really cool as a person, she might love the Harry Potter though because I grew up watching Harry Potter. I'm just like you, bro. I love it so much. Put in the comment section, do you love Harry Potter? I know some of you guys are young, but I love Harry Potter, bro. That's like one of my favorite movies. Bro, I feel embarrassed for you, bro. You literally have no text messages. You just spamming words. Don't don't lie, y'all. Y'all ever had a crush on somebody and you just texting them so much and they were not replying, but it's just like you feel guilty about it because you're doing it? I know how it feels. Don't feel alone because I did it myself. Like, honestly, I know it sounds sad. Like, I don't have a girlfriend, but I did it the same. <laughs> Sent hundreds of desperate messages to her. She had not responded to a single no one. response. No lying or fantasizing could stop these facts. The miserable reality of the situation hit him like a ton of bricks. In truth, he had nothing, nor could he <laughs> ever feel the touch of a woman. Bryson wept bitterly. Bryson wept. <laughs> he really cried a river, literally, y'all. So there I was in my Hufflepuff cloak, waiting for the Hogwarts Express. I noticed a family behind me and a boy looking at me. I smiled at him and looked away, but then I noticed in line that he was staring at me. Oh, we shoot. get seated on the train, and I hear him whisper to his mom something about YouTubers, and I thought I heard him say, Emanations. I'm caught, <laughs> I thought to myself. And he said, So what are y'all's names? This kid was good. There was nothing I this could do. This kid was good. He knew, and I knew. I had to come clean. My name's Calliope McGrublin. 
Uh, I'm kidding. I came clean. My name's Bryson. Are you Haminations? Yes, no. I am. And this kid bursts into tears on the train. <laughs> I was so flustered. I didn't know what- Bro, I will be honest. I love Haminations so much. I love what you do. Honestly, I probably cry and I'm grown. Like, be honest, bro. For the comment section, would you cry if you met Heaven Nation for the first time? Like, bro, I don't know what it is. I just love Heaven Nation work, bro. I love Bryson, the character in it. I love everything, bro. So I feel what this little kid is feeling right now on the train. The parents is like, what did you do to my son? Like, did you hurt him? But reality, he just made content for YouTube, bro. <laughs> bro, it's so funny. <laughs> The kid is shy. He just getting his eyes bigger and bigger and bigger. He want to talk to him so bad, but they both is nervous. That make it just awkward right there. Hey, I feel bad. So if you ever see him in person, I advise you just to say hi. So you won't be on a YouTube video. Please say hi to him because he will get embarrassed though. In the worst way, in front of millions of kids. What <laughs> happened? Oh, literally, bro. I'm scared of dogs. And if you would have done that to me, I would be screaming just like that person was. Really appreciate you guys cops. watching the videos, <laughs> and I love meeting you. Thanks for watching, and thanks to everyone who has said hi to me. And remember, fame isn't worth chasing because it isn't real, and we all live in a simulation, and none of this matters in the world. Oh, long should run. we live in Bye. a simulation? Thank you for watching the video, and a special thank you to Bryce. Bro, hey, fame is not worth chasing, man. Just do what you love to do, and just be happy and be glad. Who's glad today? Put in the comment section. Not only that, I've got a question for all you guys who's watching this. I want to ask, how long have you been watching me for? And what is something that you wanted to become in life? Do you want to become a doctor? Do you want to become a YouTuber? Put in the comment section right now. And guess what? I'm going to VidCon this year. I don't know when VidCon is. I think it's this summer. And I'm going to TwitchCon. So if you ever see me, don't be scared to say hello. Because I'm not a scary person, bro. But I love Hamination. I love what Hamination do. That was a great video. I was surprised that he even dropped again. He barely uploads. But I love you guys. Do me a huge favor. Subscribe. Because we're on a road to 100,000 subscribers. And, and as soon as we get to 100,000 subscribers, I'm planning on giving people a PS5 and a new iPhone. Because I know a lot of you guys are going to be bored this summer. And you guys want to play video games. But you gotta get me to 100,000 subscribers, and I will make that dream come true. 